we're having a bit of a game day today because a friend has dropped us off a couple of pheasants and we paid for them with four jars of our preserves and more recently I lent a friend of mine this. This is my air rifle and he was off to shoot some bunnies and uh, he got a number of them and as a thank you for lending the gun he's dropped this off for me so what we're going to do now is skin and gut this rabbit. First job after that is to remove the legs at the joint. Well, one of the things I want to do with this bunny is to actually save its fur because we're going to at some point in the future assemble a fur coat for myself. Now I reckon I'll need about 30 of those skins, of those pelts. Uh, so I've got one in the freezer, I've got that one there, only 28 to go. Right, a sharp knife or pair of heavy duty scissors and cut up the legs so that we can eventually peel this back, peel back the skin. Well as you can see I've now rolled back the skin from down the legs and I can get my finger through there, my thumb rather, so I'm going to cut that and then this is going to be the challenging bit because I'm going to try and roll this right the way down the body. But as you can see you need to just roll it down, peeling it down until you get to the neck. And as you can see the guts are starting to spill out a bit so I'm going to take those out because what we don't want is the digestive tract to burst and rupture all over the meat. So I just need to get the skin over the legs and down to the neck like this. Right, I've cut off the tail and as you can see that's the, the body now ready to have a quick rinse before it goes into the freezer because we're not using this fresh. Well, obviously we don't need the head left on the skin so that can go off and as you can see it is still as a, a tube of fur, I suppose you could describe it. Now, that will be wrapped in greaseproof paper and we'll put that in the freezer uh, and keep adding to them as we get more furs, uh, more rabbit skins in and eventually when we've got enough of them I'll be making myself that fur coat that I've promised. <laughs> 